So we're going to look at uh, a little more difficult sine cos graphs now. Look at this thing here. We go that A is our amplitude. Get a different colour pen. B helps us find the period. So we know that period equals 360 divided by the B. This one is our horizontal shift. And the D here is the vertical shift. So it's all a bit tight there. Same thing for the cos. So we'll go through that again. You see the A leaves us the amplitude. The B helps us find the period. 360 divided by that number gives us the period. The C is the horizontal shift left and right. And D is the vertical shift up and down. And the same for cos here. Let's work backwards. It gives us some more space. This is the vertical shift. The D. The C is the horizontal shift. The B helps us find the period. We know that period equals 360 degrees divided by the B. And the A is, of course, the amplitude. The number in front is the amplitude, how far up and down it goes. Perfect. And there's your notes.